Are you an adult? Do you like spending your hard-earned money on naked men? <laughs> well then, I have the offer for you. I have made an OnlyFans. It's the first line in the description, go check it out. This rest of the video is showing you the difficulties I had last week and all the funny things that happened while taking nude pictures outside. So I'm very new to it, I don't, I don't really know what I'm doing yet, I'm just taking a lot of nature pics. The kind of pictures that usually get deleted off Instagram, um, they're all going there, It'll be a collection of things. So now whenever I'm outside I'm taking new photos. So this is something completely new for me to try, it's different to YouTube, different to making crystals, so it's probably something fun. Uh, if you want to check it out, the link is down the side of the So OnlyFans is a subscription-based service, just like Patreon, where you throw a bit of money each month at me, and then you get all the content on the feed. But then if I make anything that's more exclusive, I can send that via DMs. I'll be answering all the DMs that I get over there, so it's a nice way to, for people to communicate with me, because it'll be a smaller space than my Instagram or YouTube. It's easier for me to get back to everyone. So if you ever wanted to see me just naked in nature, enjoying life uncensored, then that's the space. If this isn't for you, then obviously, don't worry, you can watch this vlog that I made anyway of me spending a whole week taking pictures. But yeah, I just wanted to give it a go, something fun and new to try. There is a there is a reason why I'm doing it. I'm trying to move from making crystal necklaces to streaming full time. It's my, been my dream job for a long time, for years. I just want to have long, unfiltered conversations with you guys, live feedback and be able to play games and just chat. Uh, I've been consuming a lot of Twitch content lately and. Yeah, it's just been a dream to do that myself. And the only way I can do it is I need I need to raise some money to buy a new PC. The MacBook that I edit on, it's about seven years old. It's about to die. Uh, so I need a new PC anyway. And then... <laughs> I've tried everything. I've tried to raise money in all kinds of ways, and this is just another thing that I'm trying. This doesn't take away from the YouTube content. I'm still going to be posting every week on the main channel, every week on the second channel. So you're still getting eight videos a week on YouTube for free. Uh, this is just something additional that I'll be doing on the side for fun. Yeah, we'll see how creative I can get with it. I like to be transparent with where my money's going, why I'm trying to raise money. I want to reinvest it into a PC so that I can make more content for you guys. It'll be daily live streams when I pull this off. So yeah, if you want to help me get there, if you're not interested in the nudity, if you just want to throw money at me to help me get this PC, then go check it out. It's right there. Also, my Amazon wish list with all the computer parts are also on my OnlyFans. So if you're if you have mad money and you want to do something crazy, then you can help me build the PC. But uh, yeah, that's why I'm doing it. But I'm going to have fun with it too. It's not, I'm not going to treat this like work. This is just something funny for me. I'm not trying to take it too seriously. I'm not trying to take myself too seriously. Yeah, I'm just naked in nature. This is something I've been doing forever. But now I'm producing it in a way that is shareable for people that actually care. Alright, so enjoy the vlog. This is me spending a week taking nudes outside for the first time. Enjoy. So this is day one of shooting for my OnlyFans. I just found this bathtub outside, but there's also five beehives over there. The bees keep coming over here and drinking the water, and I have 10 seconds to take the picture. So I take the picture, run across these rocks, jump in this bath full of rocks, trying to avoid the bees. It's pretty funny. <sighs> but yeah, day one. The funniest thing just happened. I took a nude shot on that road. I was hesitating so much because Cyclists keep going past. <laughs> so I had it all set up, I had the shot ready, and then a van comes and he just stops. And I'm like, you can go ahead. And he starts saying stuff in Spanish. And I'm like, dude, I wish I could talk, I just can't speak your Spanish yet. So he, he left. But <laughs> he was very friendly. And then I, I quickly took my shorts off, ran in the road, did the shot. <laughs> ran back, threw my shorts back on, put both my legs through the one in the hole. So my shorts were all like skewed like that, and it was really comfortable. And then immediately after, all these cyclists go past. Like they've been having a race all day or something. But see what I mean? <laughs> and there's a timer on the on the camera. I've got 10 seconds to do it. So I was naked in the road for 10 seconds, but I got the shot. <laughs> all right, this is the last shot of the day. 
This one came out my favorite. It was quite difficult to set up, uh, but I pulled it off. Yeah, I'll show you what I just did. So there's this pool down here. It's the only bit of water I could find today. And uh, yeah, I had to kind of slide down this rock here and just jump in because I only have 10 seconds to do it. So I just had to slide down the rock. I kept my shoes on, just landed. And then the shot just came out really nice, I don't know. All right, day one is complete. I'm getting bitten so bad by mosquitoes today because I'm down by a river. Yeah. Now it's an abandoned house, we've been kind of quiet. And it has this beautiful staircase on the side. It has this here. I thought it was really cool, so I took some pictures there. I'm being so sneaky. I'm just assuming it's abandoned. It looks pretty abandoned. I'm being so sneaky, just getting any shots. All right, dog, the dog is hurting us. So I gotta get out of here. So beautiful out here. All right, I'm done shooting for today. It's day two finished. Uh, it's been fun. It's been difficult because there's been a lot of people around, I'm like in a in a very public area at the moment. But that just adds a bit more fun to it for me. <laughs> just trying to avoid everybody. So I got one of the shots that I really wanted to take. I had like a reference photo and I kind of mimicked that. Luckily I got it. I got the shot, it looks beautiful. Just took some shots on this bamboo. I don't know how they turned out, but day two over. So I took a shot by this log here with the river in the background. It's gonna look so nice when I edit all the colors and stuff. I saw this one yesterday and I just had to be mad. It's been going well, but a man just showed up with his dog and just did like a circle around the building. I was naked just trying to hide around corners. Luckily he didn't come inside, but it took him ages to leave, so I wasted time here. Got two more ideas in this area. Yeah, day three. It's a pretty cool building. I quite like it out here. thing before anybody goes ahead and subscribes the only thing I'm keeping off of off of OnlyFans or off the internet is my penis that's one rule I kept for myself is don't don't sell your penis <laughs> I like to keep that in real life yeah just so everyone's aware that's not gonna be there but everything else goes who knows what I end up creating I'd like to collaborate with some other other people that do OnlyFans yeah just have fun with it all right